Uh, <laughs> skyline photographer extraordinaire. Yeah. I added the extraordinaire. <laughs> Welcome to Coffee with Courtney. I'm here today at Wild Detectives, a local favorite. A lot of locals come to hang out here, such as my good friend, Joseph Hopper. Well, hey. Hi. You ready to come join me for coffee? Absolutely. Awesome. Well, thanks for being here. Let's go. What do you guys do special? Well, what's special about this is we cater towards everything that's local around here in like Bishop Arts, Oak Cliff. So we serve Oak Cliff coffee from down the street, as well as dude sweet mochas. We do that. We serve Emporium pies. We do pastries from Rush Patisserie. We do Zakti, which is a local tea place here. So what are you going to get? Oh, I'm going to get Actually fortunate enough, um, very proud. I'm in this month's issue, the June issue oh, of D Magazine. Yes. Yeah, I this is the first magazine I ever uh, knew about in DFW, and I used to oh. get a subscription to it. I got a new one to, to yeah. actually finally be in it. Is just it, it's still like ugh. something that you've been. Making yeah, about. absolutely, awesome. absolutely. Uh, I think uh, as an artist, which I, I am. Um, yeah. It's all evolution. You uh, you start once with some point, and then you end up to another point, and then you end up to another point. Um, I'm at the point where I'm taking a lot of uh, architecture um, and uh, cityscape, landscape photos, and I'm enjoying the heck out of it. From what you've done already, just sharing your perspective with people. What have you found? Like, what's the feedback? Do you see that people have changed by your work? I mean, I know as an outsider, I kind of, I've seen that from your work, honestly. But what do you see from, as an artist? What people see in my work is what I see. And Good. that's my passion. I want people to enjoy the space, too. Yeah. And so that's a big part of the love that I put into my work. I want, I don't use filters. I don't uh, like manipulating things. I want people to see things exactly how I'm seeing them. I know there's a lot of incredible photographers, there's a lot of incredible, incredible artists in this uh, in this city. It's a, it's a big artist town. I, I don't really think about, you know, what other people are doing or, you know, what's going on or if, I, if I'm making an impact or not. It's just, it's, the only, the most I'll do is a personal self-reflection. I'm just like, am I putting out you know, the things that I want out. Uh, anytime I photograph the Pegasus or something very specific, I'll get uh, people, they're like, I grew up here. And they'll tell me all these stories about, yeah. yeah, exactly, like my father, you know. I'm talking to a gentleman, uh, and he's 65, 66, and he's like, my dad took me to see the original Pegasus, and the mayor was there, and, and just all these fascinating things. And it's it's uh, it's stuff like that that you don't expect no. uh, for people to reach out to you and go like you you you've captured something that uh, drew something out a, a wonderful memory. Well, thank you guys for joining me again today. I really learned a lot here while at Wild Detectives about the awesome coffee and the local scene here and then talking to Joseph Hobart about how he's making an impact through photos and capturing the city and all that it does and represents and really kind of taking his passion and turning it into an amazing career. And please remember guys that if you have something innovative going on, contact me so we can set up an interview. Use the hashtag Coffee with Courtney G and we'll get you on the books. We'll see you next time. I am on page 17. What? I got oh, a full page. Huge. Boom. That is beautiful. And you're credited and you're there. I am. I'm, I'm there. Teeny <laughs> tiny in the bottom. <laughs>